Study Dog's learnings, adventure, and reading's purpose is to help every child read from grades pre-K to second grade. The program helps a child master core reading skills by combining multimedia and game-like graders. The Study Dog curriculum is based on effective research and supported instruction. Each program engages the students in a different aspect of reading. It covers phonomic awareness, where there are sound isolations, sound-to-word matching, and word-to-word -word matching. Overall, phonics are, are focused on as well because each phenome is isolated for the student so that they can hear the sounds each letter makes. Another skill integrated into this software is fluency. The program reads stories out loud using familiar sounds and words. There is also rich story content that keeps the students engaged and interested. The graphics also have this impact. Vocabulary is integrated into the lessons as well. The meanings of words are learned as well as their relation to known words and ideas to increase comprehension. Lastly, comprehension is practiced in each activity as students can decide which words to choose and construct meanings from them. Some of the relative advantages for this software are that if students have problem with vowel sounds, they can hear the sounds out loud and see the letters. If they struggle with reading comprehension, they are given choices and small pieces of information at a time. The activity for contractions is a great visual tool for understanding how a word is condensed and made into a contraction and where the punctuation should be placed. If students struggle with spelling, they can sound out the letters aloud with anim an animated bug in the activity. Overall, the software is fun, appealing, and easy for students to navigate around and learn by. Step 1. Getting started. Here the child can choose their activity from the organized list displaying each game. Step 2. Each activity demonstrates a different skill. There can be anywhere from 1 to 4 lessons in each reading activity. An orange ring around the number means the lesson was not completed. If the ring is red and green, the student finished the lesson but did not master it. A green ring represents completion and mastery of the lesson. This is a good way for teachers to keep track of students' progress. Step 3. Each lesson is an is an exciting and visually appealing activity. The game takes up the whole screen to avoid distractions from the students and the characters promote active engagement. The coins at the bottom of the screen change color to represent successful progress. Step four. This is a good tool for the classroom because it will prevent reading difficulties, help struggling students, reinforce reading skills, and will allow the children to have fun. In the spelling activity, students must choose the correct letter to fix the word. If they choose the wrong letter, they have to try. They have a chance to try again. As you can see, this is a fun way for students to learn how to spell and master their existing skills. The vowel blends activity. Um, in this example, four words are shown, and the letter A is clearly sounded out as a long vowel. The student is able to hear the sounds and see different words that use this vowel sound. Now, what's your deal? Do you need me to make you a meal? We need to find the Lost Island potion ingredients. We're helping Dr. Z. Oh, yeah. Dr. Z is boom, as in shaboom. I'll let you in on a little secret. I've got what you need, but it'll cost you. How about we answer some trivia questions about one of those books, and you give us what you have for free? Knock yourself out. Try this one. The title of this book is The Ogre and the Dusty Box, and it was written by Jerry the Jester. Now for the first trivia question. What do you think this story is about? How the ogre found the old book. How the ogre made a new book. How the ogre likes to read books. How the ogre fa How the ogre Amazing work! Okay, let's read the story together. When you're ready to move to the next page,